One thing I've sorely missed this year are more intimate movies. Theater shutdowns and production halts have thrown much of Hollywood's plans out the window. And while some studios have opted for streaming releases, most of what we've gotten have either been bigger named family films or indie flicks already destined for streaming. What we haven't gotten as much of are the smaller, personal films, Oscar contenders and the like, whether from large studios or independent ones that truly make you feel. With only a handful releasing here or there, this week we dove into an Amazon original, The Sound of Metal, which saw a small, short-lived theatrical release in November before arriving on Amazon Prime December 4th. Starring Riz Ahmed as Ruben Stone, a drummer in his own two-person heavy metal band, Black Gammon, alongside his girlfriend and band singer Lou, played by Olivia Cook. Lou and Ruben have managed to book a small tour, but one evening Ruben's hearing becomes muffled and impaired. This becomes more and more frequent as Ruben begins to lose his hearing entirely. Concerned about Ruben and his health as a recovering drug addict, Lou contacts Ruben's rehab sponsor Hector, who finds a community focused on helping those to learn to deal with being deaf. Ruben is at first reluctant to go and sets his sights entirely on saving for implants to help him regain his hearing. Eventually convinced to join the community, Ruben faces internal conflict of learning how to be still and at peace versus his blind determination to regain what cannot be brought back. The Sound of Metal is fully the story of one man's lesson in acceptance and a new outlook on life. Despite its synopsis, it is much more than the story of a drummer who loses his hearing but is instead about a man facing adversity and learning valuable life lessons that will change his life for the better despite his circumstances. Brilliant and moving, The Sound of Metal may not be the most original in its delivery, but its story is unique and heartfelt. Riz Ahmed as the angry and resentful recovering addict who refuses to see the truth gives a powerful performance and while sometimes an unlikable lead due to his character's bitterness, this only adds to the character's realism and relatability. The smaller moments as Ruben begins to connect with others and learn to finally stop and appreciate what he does have are all the more effective because of his more grating character flaws. All of this, of course, is thanks to the direction of Darius Martyr in his feature film directorial debut. Martyr's film takes us through an emotional journey of a man who showcases all the stages of grief on screen and comes out a better person despite his loss. The film isn't a masterpiece, it shares some common cliches and tropes with other films regarding musicians and drug addicts. But its emotional resonance is perfectly done and the characters and situations feel real. Ruben's reactions, denial, resentment, anger, and acceptance are all relatable and the film's closing moments will linger with you. I give The Sound of Metal three out of four stars.